Hello, friend Beecher Moorfield here, and welcome to Make It a Great Day. Alvin Toppler said this, li li that powerful statement, listen, the illiterate of the 21st century will not be those who cannot read and write, but will be those who cannot learn, unlearn, and relearn. What a statement. What a, what a powerful statement. He was right. You, you see, there, there's an avenue. I, I use the term avenue for learning. The, the avenue for learning a long time ago was just learning to read and write. And, I, and I'm going to tell you why. There was a time in American history and in, 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 in American education when reading and writing was the basics and and, and truth was taken for granted. Well, my friend, sadly to say, while we still need to learn, we still need to know how to read and write. And, and, I, and I tell you today, that has, that has suffered so much. Penmanship suffers in our school systems today. Spelling, grammar. Young people are graduating from college today and cannot conjugate simple verbs. Something is wrong. But what's even worse than that. What they are receiving that is being called education is not always true. They're throwing a lot of ideas around, a lot of squirrely stuff around, and people really don't take anything home from that. So the people that are going to be successful in the 21st century uh, are, are not just the ones that can read and write. That's still important. And if you don't know how to write well, you better learn. But listen to what I'm saying. Just as important today as reading and writing, because of all that's being said, because of the availability of so much stuff that's not necessarily true, you must also need to know how to learn, that is, discover what works, unlearn what doesn't work, and relearn, that is, how to think so you can know the difference. You need to put those things to work in your life. You need to be able to learn what works. You need to unlearn what doesn't work. And you need to be able to relearn so that you can think to discover the difference in what works and what doesn't work. Why don't you get on Learning Avenue today and travel there a little bit? every day. You'll be surprised what you come out with and make it a great day.